This one USB drive can store as many operating systems as you like. Feels too good to be true, right? All you need is a USB drive with good storage capacity. Let me show it to you first. For testing, I installed three operating systems, Windows 10, Windows 11 and Ubuntu on this USB drive. You can use this drive to install any of these operating systems onto your desktop whenever you like. For this method, we will be using a tool called Ventoy. Ventoy is an open source tool that creates a bootable USB drive. Head over to your browser and search Ventoy on Google. Now, click on the download link and you will be redirected to the official Ventoy website. To download it, you can either click here or visit their GitHub page for the latest version. Under Releases, click on the latest available version. Just scroll down below, download the Windows version of the zip file and save it to your desktop. Now right click on the zip, click on Extract All and extract all the contents of this zip file onto your desktop. Once the files have been extracted, double click on the exe file to run the Ventoy application. Here, click on more info and then click on run anyway button. Now, insert your USB drive. Once inserted, click on the refresh button to refresh the device's list. As soon as you refresh it, your USB drive will be visible. Once the USB is detected, just click on the install button. Now type in yes and click on OK. Make sure you don't have anything important saved onto this USB drive. Ventoy will completely format this drive and your data will be lost. Once the process is complete, you can click on the OK button and this will exit the Ventoy application. The next step is to download the ISO files of the operating systems you want to boot from this USB drive. So, here is the list of supported operating systems that you can boot using the Ventoy tool. It includes Windows, Linux, Unix, Chrome OS and several other operating systems. For this test, I will be downloading the Windows 10 ISO, Windows 11 ISO and Ubuntu ISO files. You can just go to Google or follow the on-screen instructions to download the required ISO files. If you wish to boot more operating systems, you can download the required files from their official websites. Once all the ISO files have been downloaded, the last step is to copy and paste them onto your USB drive. With Ventoy, you don't need to format the disk over and over again. You just need to copy the ISO files to the USB drive and boot them directly. You can copy as many files at a time and Ventoy will give you a boot menu to select them. Once the files have been copied, this should be the final output of the USB drive. Now restart your system and go into the boot menu. For my system, I have to press F12. You can also go to your BIOS settings and change your boot priority to a USB drive. The boot menu key 
may vary depending upon your system. You can find the right boot key for your system by just googling it. Once booted, you can select the USB drive from which you want to boot into Ventoy. You can now find the operating systems that are available on the USB drive and select the one that you wish to install. Now, let's try to boot into Windows 10. Just select Windows 10 and press Enter. Now select Boot into Normal Mode and press Enter. Press Enter again where it says Press any key to boot from CD DVD to proceed with the installation of Windows 10. So, that's it for today. I hope you have enjoyed this tutorial. If you face any issues, just comment below and I will get back to you. See you in the next one.